here with Brian today and we've just driven down from Kamloops, beautiful drive down Highway 5A. We're at uh, Stony Lake Lodge on the Douglas Lake Ranch uh, lands and today we're joined by Kyle Meeker who uh, won our first anniversary app contest. That's right. Yeah. So we're going to spend the day on the water. We've got uh, Ryan Ermit with us, our social media manager. He keeps Brian and I honest, making sure we're posting on the uh, Still Water Fly Fishing app, uh, Facebook and uh, Instagram pages. And of course we've got Brent Gill from Wait For It Films. He's capturing this whole day for us. So we're looking forward to getting out on the water. The lake looks to be in good shape. What do you say we go out there and uh, see if we can figure out what's going on? Definitely, yeah, pretty excited. Buckle this trip with these two guys. So uh, first time at Stony. Yeah. And uh, what do you think, Brian? Gonna be a good day? Oh, hopefully we'll catch some. I'm sure we'll find some fish. I think we will. <laughs> well, let's head down to the boat. Brian, why this spot? What, what what makes you like it so much here? We've got a, a nice breeze to anchor, uh, so we're casting parallel to the edge of the drop-off. Use our sounder, find yep. out where the drop starts, and we're right on the slope in 15, 16 feet of water. And we've seen the odd fish move out here, so we know they're cruising back and forth here. Just got to figure out what they're yeah. doing. Yeah, so we've got, we'll hang a, I'll hang the coronamid, uh, get a bigger, larger fly, stand out in the crowd, and. You and Kyle are stripping the, the boobies. That's why you get the long handle Moby. <laughs> so Ryan can spill the cherries. Right in the lens. Right, the corona, Take this for a pattern. That's called prawn. You're, you're observing something here, folks. <laughs> Brian Chan, <laughs> Captain Coronamid, the Coronamid King. We've lost the rubber. Him. He's gone to <laughs> prawn and rubber. You have to send out a tsunami warning before you fish this, though, so, because it pushes. Your <laughs> dams are swimming around. Yeah? Well, oh, have to get your fly out. Oh, yeah. I actually remember when you asked me to get another one, I yeah. found another set of eyes. I died second one. Oh. oh. I think we might pump this one. Oh, I'm going to share it with my thoughts in a minute. I still got one. Well, we were actually moving to another location and Brian spotted fish rolling uh, between us. We're in about 18 feet of water, but it comes right up into the tulies here. And we've got uh, more and more damselflies moving around. So I've switched up to a hover line that sinks at about one inch per second with a little damsel booby on and trying to see if we can uh, induce one of these fish to come up and roll on it and take the damsel. We've got to keep those flies high up in the water column where they're feeding. So we'll see if we can close the deal here. Now, of course, the fish will stop moving because they know we're here.
same old and it's same old. I don't know why. Okay. So Brian, moving? What do we want to do? Let's move. We're moving. Let's go the trench. Yeah, I mean, the temperature still, it's just 60 degrees, so there's lots of fish in shallow water. We know they're going to go yeah. in there, so and we're going to go looking. And we've seen some damsels moving yep. around here, so yeah. might be a chance for Kyle to put his fly to work. Solve the mystery. Plus, this is tiring. <laughs> Plus, this is really hard. Yeah. So, Phil, as a as a subscriber to the app, like I subscribe to the app, what benefits am I getting that uh, people who don't subscribe to the app? Uh, what's the difference? What, what's the benefit to this? Well, a subscriber? each subscribe sorry, each chapter rather has a limited amount of free content. Um, as an app subscriber, of course, you've got access to the entire. Suite of tips we put through all the chapters, and also as a as a beneficiary as well. Every month, or on an average a month, Brian and I are uploading what four to five new video tips. We've probably got a list of over 200 tips we still got to add to this app. Um, so you're getting the benefit of those because the majority of those are subscriber-based app tips as well. So. Yeah. <laughs> okay, watch your dog. Now Brian's gonna put one on your face. Oh man, now I gotta. Oh, Brian. Okay, that's out. There you go, Kyle. Good one. Oh, yeah. Oh, we got company. Oh, we got company. Brian's favorite fish. Look at nice that. Nice one. Nice fish, Kyle. Beautiful. <laughs> Yeah. Like, uh, way to go. You want to you want to kiss it? Um, I'll pass. <laughs> Appreciate it. Let him breathe and recover. Off he goes. Oh, sorry. <laughs> yes, sir. Oh. oh, I thought I had him. Oh, I got him. All right. I think I know what my job is today. Five more minutes and we're done. My name is Ryan Ermit. Uh, they call me the social media manager, but truly I was just an avid fly fisher and fly tire who's been hooked on stillwater fly fishing uh, since I was very young. I should probably check, but I think I was one of the first to download and subscribe the app. But I remember waiting for its release with the same enthusiasm we all stare at our indicators with. The knowledge that I have obtained is off the charts. And just thankful that I get to work with these two now. But like most of us, I too started stillwater fly fishing by aimlessly trolling a Sproutly around the lake with no rhyme or reason as to why or why I wasn't catching any fish. I remember fumbling through learning indicators and chronomids for years with limited success, hours of frustration, trying to remember what they said on those DVDs or how to tie that knot from the YouTube video. Stillwater app is packed with a multitude of tips, tricks, info, and years of experience that you can take on the water with you. If you too want to up your Stillwater game, download and subscribe. Well Kyle, and, uh, we've got uh, a little goodie package here for you from uh, Islander Fly Reels, one of their new hats, uh, and uh, one of their patented t-shirts that are actually made in Canada. Yeah. And uh, so it's pretty cool. Yeah. Islander, and it'll uh, hope nice. it serve you well, and little uh, logo you can new boat sticker. You might want yeah. to put that on your boat. Awesome. And again, uh, Great to have you out on the water Thanks today, and I uh, hope you it. enjoyed yourself. Yeah, it's great to uh, spend time much. with you, Kyle. And Islander is one of our Chapter Six partners, and uh, always new, always room for new partners. So, if you're interested? <laughs> Come Brian and I. <laughs> Get on the app.